Hey everyone, welcome back to Kabuki Mat Reviews. Keeping up with the theme of superstars who are no longer with us, this time I'm going to be reviewing WWE Legends Series 2, Ravishing Rick Rude. Right off the bat, you're going to notice that Rick Rude is the short hair version. He's also supporting the entrance attire and the wrestling attire of his 1990 SummerSlam match against the Ultimate Warrior. Let's start off by taking a look at his coat. His coat features gold-like material around the collar. The back has a gold lettering that says simply ravishing. The entire coat is covered in golden dots. The fabric is really thin and almost see-through, and there's no gold on the inside of the sleeves. This could be a problem for some collectors. The coat is easily removed unlike some of the other jackets and coats that have come out with WWE figures from Mattel. Let's check out the head scan. Right off the bat, you can tell that Ravishing Rick Rude is duck facing. He has his 70 porn star mustache and he's featuring his short hair. Now the short hair version might be a problem for some people because some people mostly remember him with his long curly hair. Me personally, I like the short hair version and since we got the long curly hair version in the Jack's Classic Superstars collection, I'm not too mad about seeing a short hair version right off the bat. Now let's check out the body. The body type fits pretty good, it's an elite style, and he actually shares the same body as Kofi Kingston's elite. This actually works well because Ramachine Rick Rude was never a super muscular guy, but he was always really cut. He even features a tattoo on his right arm of his anchor. Getting down to the attire, it the colors are really bright and vibrant. One thing you'll notice is the missing designs on the back, which is a huge letdown to a lot of people. The front features Rick Rude's head. And the sides features the words Hute Returns. The boots have molded shoelaces which are painted white and the soles are white. One side of one boot says Simply and the other side says Ravishing. So all in all, what do you think of Rick Rude? Is he simply ravishing or is he just rude? Does the figure live up to your standards of the WWE Mattel Legends figures? Or is there another attire you would prefer? Either way, let me know. I'd like to hear more comments. I certainly hope you've added this figure to your collection. I certainly hope the Legends line continues and we get to see more wrestlers and more attires. And one more thing. I'm doing a contest and anyone who comments and leaves their opinion on a figure on any of my videos for this month's theme and say you want to enter the contest, I will put you in a drawing for this WWE Rumblers R-Truth figure. I'll try to have a contest every month with every theme. Thanks for tuning in. See you next time.